I always thought I'd die in the line of duty. Caught in the crossfire of the endless gang wars or riots that were part of my daily life. But as a cop in Vanguard City, I was ready for it. Yeah, I was ready. I was one of the lucky people. I had a job, a wife, a child, a roof over my head. I could live within the specter of death if it meant leaving behind a legacy, a piece of me. But now, now I've got nothing. In a few minutes I'll be dead, and I won't feel the pain anymore. The pain of knowing that I couldn't, that I couldn't even save her. Minus them camp! These crazies! These pigs fell of sin! Them raised hand of blood to us! They! They must die for this to begin! Tormentos eternos! The things I've seen, that I've done, they all seem surreal. Like some faded memory of another life. But this pain is all too real. It's all that remains of what was once my life. Before war even existed as an idea, then they came and destroyed all that we had. They took our children as their own and made us slaves. This must be our fate. We have lived as fools for ages, unaware of our own false existence and our inevitable demise. We should have seen this coming, and maybe we could have stopped them. But now, now it's too late. The sacrifice we sent to you. Have praise, our lords. Take this offering. More shall send we. You prepare die. Sometimes I wonder if my life before this chaos ever really existed, or if it's just something I've imagined. Maybe this inversion of my life, this hell that has literally turned my world upside down, is just part of some warped dream or delusion. Whatever it is, it will all be over soon. Soon enough. Wait, Davis, where are you going? Leo, I told you already, I gotta run home for a minute. You can wait here if you want. I'll pick you up on my way back. I got nothing to do here, partner. I'll take a ride with you. So, I couldn't wait until the end of the day. Oh, wait! You were going home for a... <laughs> Sorry, you think I could take a hint after all these years? Hey, I could, uh, 
I can wait in the car while you do your thing. That's really funny. I'm not going home for, uh, today's Layla's birthday, you know, and, uh, we might not make it home till late, so I want to give her a present before bedtime. You know how it is. No. I really don't. You're going soft on me, man. You're even wearing a bracelet. That's a friendship bracelet. A friendship bracelet? What's that, a new fad? Something like that. Uh, you know, you give it to someone you love and wear one yourself. It's what all the kids are asking for. Wow, and you're wearing one too. You do have a sensitive side after all. Uh, being a dad changes things. Start looking at the world a bit differently. Yeah, but sometimes you can take it overboard. Like that pitch you got on the dashboard. I mean, how many convicts do you think are gonna intimidate with all that happiness staring them from the front seat? Convicts? I'm not worried about intimidating cons. They know what I can do if they act up. Watch it! Wow, that was close. We should follow that guy, what do you think? Nah, just radio it in. Traffic guys will take care of him. Yeah, I know. Priorities. You got a present to drop off. Station L23 to station C10. We have a CO5 on Highlander. I repeat, a CO5 request. Oh shit! What the hell was that? I have no fucking idea. Hey, did you hear that? Let's grab the weapons. We have to find out what's going on here. You're right, let's move. Come on, let's move. Nothing. They don't look like anyone I've ever seen. Never seen a gun like this before. Who the hell would need guns like this? We should call Central and check in. This might be citywide. I left the radio in the car. I'll go back and see what I can find out. I think we need backup. Let's get up to my apartment and call C-10. I want to make sure that Kara and Layla are safe. Okay. What the hell? This thing is floating. Hey, Leo, we gotta go.
Wow. How did you do that? I just put it there. What the fuck? Go! Go! destroyed. Let's get to my apartment and call HQ. There's a back entrance. No, the streets are all backed up. We might be on our own for now. to the parking lot and Stairs, third floor. Let's go. Watch it.
gotta get out of here. Quick! Enemy on the stairs! The place is on the third floor. Did you see that? Do you hear me? Uh, Layla. Layla. She's... Layla. Where is she? She's... Uh, they... They... Uh, uh, no. No. Kara. Caroline, open your eyes. Open your eyes, baby. Come on. Oh, come on, Kara. Please. Oh, oh shit, David. <laughs> from us! cells for what seemed like months. It must have been just a few weeks. As those around us seemed to lose their hope and their sanity from the isolation, I thought about Layla, and the hope that she had somehow survived kept me going, even if I knew I could never escape this place. Until one day Fitzgerald arrived, and we learned that it was not lost. Move! Move the cage! Go! Yo! Lock cage! <laughs> Half list! <laughs> Fuck, my head hurts. 
No wonder. You whacked you pretty good. What the fuck are you looking at? Who the hell are you anyways? We're the same as you. We're prisoners. We got grabbed during the invasion. Same, eh? How many of these fuckers have you killed? A few. But I haven't even got started yet. Well, I'm just about done. My name's Fitzgerald. I've been out in the streets with a gang of fighters since this thing started. I was fighting alongside my brother. He... He didn't make it. Fighters? I'm Davis Russell. This is Leo Delgado. Sorry about your brother. You said you were with a gang of fighters. Were you fighting the Ludadors? Yeah. We were going after Kilter, their leader, when we got ambushed outside their base. I'm not sure anyone else survived. Was there anyone else in the city? My child. My daughter is out there. Are there any children? Any little girls? Children? Not a single one, you know? I haven't seen a child since the invasion. I think they might all have been taken to- Over cage! Yes. They're coming back, get your bunks. Shit. Move, Scott! Work again! I don't like this, D. I really don't like this. Find out soon enough. Whoa, what the hell is causing that? Path is blocked. Try using your uh, grav link to clear the passage. Shit. We're stuck. No way out. At least it didn't land on us. Come on, we'll find another way around. There's no way across. Hey, look up. Hey, maybe we can somehow create a bridge. Hey, this crap is gonna make things heavy, too. Now. 
Hold up for me. Come on, this way. Let's go, partner. This must be why we were sent down here, to take Not care of these things. Now. Get us through this. Alright, let's go. Are we going the right way? I feel like we're walking around in circles. Maybe something is freaking them out. Give me a boost. So there's hope. Can't get through this. Let's find another way. Here, these rocks should be easy to break. Use your grab link, Dave. Pass it. Good. Let's go. <clears throat> hey, look. That should help.
Dead? Oh shit. Hey, you hurt. Let me take a look. It's nothing. I'll be fine. Let's just get out of here. No, that looks bad. We need to find someone to stop the bleeding. Fuck. They found us. Check now! Not move or dead! Don't move. I think they'll shoot if we move. Emperor! What Nando? Have what? If what not that kill me! Take down box! Move! That hole. That's our way out. We'll be back here soon. Find out with the Is he hurt? What did they do? We were below ground. There were tunnels and caves everywhere. These Ludadors uh, stumbled on some kind of flying robot. Attacked us. Davis got the worst of it. A robot that flies underground. Right. Look, whatever the hell it is, we need to get you guys out of here and quick. The sick and the wounded don't last long in this place. Easier said than done. There are more guards than prisoners in this place. Yes. But I can help you get out of the barracks. Once you're outside, though, you're on your own. You can pick the lock with this. I'll distract the guards. When darkness falls, you go. Your chances are better under the cover of night. Just stay calm here. I know what I'm doing. Guard! Guard! Hey! Get over here! Come on, you hairless fuck! I'm talking to you! Come on, you dumb prick! Man of fact! You hear me? You man of fecker! Hey! Did you hear me? Come on, you sack of shit! Tim Schliff. Triple nay. Move! Move! Fuck. That was suicide. He just killed himself. There's nothing we can do. He wanted to save us. I can't waste this chance. Let's go. Let's go left. The doors might be guarded. Escaping. This window isn't locked. Looks like we can squeeze through this window. First, I'll give you a hand. Come on, D. Gotcha. Six. Job done. 
in this guidebook. Now set. Oh, he slept. Oh. Damn, sir. Voila! Ah! Uh -huh. Shit up! Let you jump! Takaya! Damn it! He's coming this way! To the left! Follow me! Come on, he's getting close! Close. Yeah. Good thing no one's bought us. Let's Just keep moving. Yes. We must rest. We must sleep. Slap that will be true. Ah! Ah! Love kills. <laughs> Left dead dead? Let's jump these two and grab their guns. Fordor is coming. It's too high. I'm not sure I can make it. We got no choice. We gotta try. Thanks. We can use these. Now I feel much better. Dumb scum. Gotta kick. Oh, I shit. think we've been hurt. Shit. Hit him. We've been spotted. Last
there! Skip him, try! Mesquel! Get him out! wound. Let's go. We'll get out of here and find something to patch you up. This is some kind of storage room. Sit down. I'll see what I can find. Okay. No. Here. Maybe on this shelf. Hey, I figured these might come in handy. What do you think? Yeah. Can't hurt. better? Yeah. This should help. Look, that's where we need to go. We need to get out of here first. Let's find a lift and get down to <laughs> the caves. Our luck. It's as if this was left for us. What? You want to block our exit? Hell yeah. That'll buy us some time. Who knows how many more they have after us. All right. But I hope this path leads somewhere or we'll be buried alive. How long we got? Let's not hang around to find out. Get up! This place is 
about to blow. Hey, Davis, check this out. We're leaving. <laughs> oh, shit. <clears throat> we just bought ourselves a head start. <clears throat> but they'll be coming. We'll send everything they have after us. We did it, Chief. <laughs> We're free men! Yeah, so, uh, listen. This is where we split up. Thanks again. Couldn't have got out of there without you. Are you crazy? I'm going with you. I'm gonna go find your daughter. No, I'll move faster on my own. Like hell you will. You just said so yourself. You couldn't have got out there on your own. And now you're thinking of going in there solo? No, we're partners. Are you sure about this? No, not really. But I got you back. All clear behind us. God, look at this. There's nothing left. Yeah. I can see. But hey, there are survivors out there. We'll find her. Yeah. She's still there. Somewhere. So many people. Dead. Yeah. I hope things look better where we used to live. Things look so different. I can't even tell where we are. Come on. Home's this way. I can't believe this. It's gone. Everything. Just gone. Let's see if there's anyone left here who can help us. Maybe some of Fitzgerald's crew survived. What's causing these things? Look. What is this thing? I've never seen anything like this before. Me neither. Settle is clear. So move, will Ned. Turn on that bilge yet. Let's say what that killed does say. Nothing here. Just trash. Here come why. Killed her. Attack here. <laughs> Kill the fear! I'll lead the no man fear! Not say so stupid! Hey! Shh! Listen! Fire! Fire! Shut them! Who turned? Kill them! Better keep a guard up. I thought this city might be empty. They're still here guarding it. Maybe that's a good sign. Jesus. More of them. They can't help us. We know where we're going. Let's get there and see if we can find some answers on our own. We're stuck. It's a dead end. Hey, maybe if we clear off that platform, we'll be able to get through. Good. Let's move. Careful. I'm not sure how stable this thing is.
Where the hell are they all coming from? And why haven't they left? The city's destroyed. They must want this place for something. All that digging going on. Hell. I think we'll find that out pretty soon. Yeah. Let's get out of here before more show up. Hold this up. Chat. Here few sectors battle witches. With few sectors? Dead most thing. Nice one, man! Click, baby! This! 
Clear! We need to be more careful. These things are everywhere. We can't fight them all. The building wall is broken. Looks like we can get by. Jeez, we're digging their way right up into the city. Where the hell are they coming from? Maybe they live underground. No, it doesn't fit. If they lived underground, they wouldn't need a thing. Something else. There, Russ. Just another few blocks. Give me a hand. I don't know if I'd call this flying. It's more like floating. We're getting the hang of it. It's not so tough. Come on. Just leap from object to object. Solid ground. All right, we're here. No more need. We'll be okay. Layla! Layla! Damn it! Where are you? It was then that it dawned on me. My life was over. There was nothing worth living for and nothing worth fighting for. It was all. It was all just gone. No. This can't be. But hope has a funny way of interfering with reality. No matter how irrational it might seem. Where are you? She was gone. But without her. Without the thought that she might be out there. I would have just sat down and let those bastards take me. Hope can play tricks on you. And so it turns out and those that you truly trust. Daddy, I gotta ask you something. Davis, I, uh, heard gunfire outside. There is nothing here for us. 
Now let's get out of here. You promised me you would take me on a trip to the edge. You promised. Just you and me. Let's go. Follow me.